he's had a pretty amazing career if you think about it. Minor leagues have more minor league home runs than any San Diego Padre in their history. Peter Gammons called you one of his favorite players. What does it mean to be on this team for you with everything you've accomplished so far in your career? It's exciting. Uh, it's nice to play on a team that has uh, you know, a common goal and a common thing in common that we're all Jewish. I mean, that's you know, that's very rare. I've never. I, I mentioned in an interview the other day that I've only, until this, you know, in 2012, I'd never played on a team with more than two Jewish guys on at a time. And I'm just using one of those dudes. And two of those other times, it was just me and Nate Fryman. So it's uh, it's exciting. It's exciting. We're having fun. I just want to have fun playing baseball, and we couldn't be having any more fun. And you also add that other element is you're also a filmmaker. When you see this, can, I mean, can you actually see this playing out almost as a film? This is a, you know a big game after the last time they were disappointed. <laughs> oh, uh, no, 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 you got to keep that down. I, I want to get the film rights for very cheap. Let's not, <laughs> let's not start telling people about the you know, possible film rights that are going to be available that I, I need to own. So <laughs> you don't let it out there. Don't, no one knows. So, uh, so mom's work for you. Really. When you play for a country, is it different than putting on a uniform? of, let's say, in a, you know, a Red Sox or well, the Padres. The way we see this, I see this, is this is not about anyone. This doesn't necessarily help out any of our careers. This is not about any one player. You know, this is something to help out an entire nation of people and bring baseball to them. That's a wonderful prospect. You know, that's something great. Uh, so to us, this is this is something this is something bigger than us. Can you see, see yourself down the road being involved in the Israeli baseball program, other than a player, maybe a coach or an ambassador, or trying to grow the game in Israel itself? I see why not? After I'm done, I mean, after I'm done playing, hopefully about ten years from now, uh, you know, there's always options of what I can do, and I, I love, you know. Who knows? Who knows what's gonna happen? I don't know. I can't see that far in the future. I thought I'd be dead by now. Mindset going into tonight's game. Uh, play it one pitch at a time. Don't take any single thing for granted. Get to the next pitch. Try, when you get on the gas pedal, do not take, take your foot off. These tournaments, you know, we had a lead last year, last time doing this. Uh, we don't want to give it up. You, need, you know, got to stay on them, be aggressive, and be smart. Uh, so I think uh, we just focus on playing our game and being in good shape. And I think we're going to have some fun tonight. That's really the You have fun playing the game, play well. Got to keep them loose, got to make them have fun. Um, and they look at guys like Ike, me, Breslow, and they, and they see how much fun we're having. You know, you know, if you guys were to watch us in the clubhouse, you'd think we were just not even remotely taking baseball seriously. But you see us out here on the field working our asses off. Um, but we're keeping as loose and as fun as possible because that's the point. It's a kid's game. If you can't keep remind yourself that it's a kid's game, what's the point of playing it? Um, you know, and it's a loose clubhouse. We're having a great time.